As always, good situational awareness. Take off those headphones. Go get one earbud, especially if you're sweeping around and doing your janitor duties. So what did I do? I took my sweet broomstick and I snapped it in half. Why? Because I train Filipino martial arts. Hey, I love Filipino martial arts and you're probably going to see sticks and knives more than you're going to see broomstick attacks these days. So that's why I snapped it in half. That's my jam. So on the first attack, what did I do? I targeted the hand. I targeted the hand. Boom, the left one came through and I smashed into the head and came around. Right, so one more time, I'm hitting the hand, hitting the hand. He's not going to be able to recycle those hands. That's why the head opens up, so the head strike came in. If you notice now, my arms are underneath. For those of you guys that don't train in Filipino martial arts, now we're going to get into our sin and wally. My love to strike or my strike that went all the way through to finish put me in this position. So when the next attack came in, my top hand goes first. Okay? Now I have to uncross myself my bottom hand targeted. So hopefully I'm hitting the hand and breaking the hand. Hopefully, definitely never a guarantee. I'm striking into the elbow, wrapping my other hand around, boom, finishing the job. If I need to do more damage, I do more damage. What's so nice about these hybrid Kali sticks from the Budo Brothers is they help actually with some vibration when you're training. These are really strong sticks as well. So how do we train that drill at home? We go left hand hit, right hand hit, left hand cut all the way through. We're in our sin and wally pattern. Remember, top hand, bottom hand, top hand. Top hand, bottom hand, bring the right arm around the head, bottom hand. That can set us into sin and wally on this side. Personally, you know, I always want my sticks on the other side because the angle one attacks or forehand strikes are stronger than backhand strikes. So if we look how we finish the drill, we start at the top. Left with the re-chamber right with rechamber left one cuts all the way through right one cut through left one cut through right come around hit and then pull back to your double chamber right i don't want to stay stuck in this position this is more of a compromised position in my books so from the top again left hand right hand cut through at the left that sets up your sin and wally right hand left hand right hand boom don't come under come back up and you're going to build the habit of wanting to come under and do all the super cool stuff that you see in the Bruce Lee movies right but really we just got to be able to know how to use those sticks get your basics down and where they should be and then play with it go have fun stay safe all right today we are going to do some destructive testing on the hybrid ebay cali i want to know how hard you have to hit it to break it now it is wood obviously there is a limit and you will be able to eventually break it but i want to know how far do we have to go to smash these i want to make sure that it's not breaking right not near the handle and if it is going to break i hope it breaks at the high point up here there's only one way to find out and that's to smash a steel pole so let's give it a go There we go, nice. That is a really good sign. It's not breaking at the handle, which is what I was scared of. It broke near the highest force impact, which is right where you wanted to, it was gonna break. That goes to show that the handle is nice and strong. And if you do end up breaking these, just shoot us an email, we'll send you a new set.